Fred, you next. He's not Fred, I am. Honestly, woman, you call yourself our mother. Oh, I'm sorry, George. I'm only joking. I am Fred. Welcome to Gryffindor. Dismal, once again, my request. I know you. You're nearly Headless Nick. I... Oh, this Quidditch player in a century. According to McGonagall. Hey, well done, Harry. Woods just told us. Fred and George are on the team, too. Beat us. Our job is to make sure that you don't get blooded up too bad. Can't make any promises, of course. Rough game, Quidditch. Brutal, but no one's died in years. Someone will vanish occasionally, but they'll turn up in a month or two. <laughs> Scared, Harry? I felt the same way before my first game. I, uh, I don't really remember. Woke up in hospital a week later. Hiya, Harry. Ron. Fred. George. What are you all doing here? Rescuing you, of course. Now, come on, get your trunk. Let's go. By the way, Harry, happy birthday. It's not much, but it's home. I think it's brilliant. Where have you been? Harry, how wonderful to see you, dear. Beds empty, no note, car gone. You could have died. You could have been seen. Of course, I don't blame you, Harry, dear. They were starving him, Mum. There were bars in his window. Well, you best hope I don't put bars on your window, Ronald Weasley. Come on. <laughs> what did I do? Morning, Weasleys! Morning, Morning Dad. Dad. What a night. Nine raids. Nine! <laughs> oh, fetch it, Willie Percy, please. Oh! And they've sent us Harry's as well. Dumbledore must... No. This lot won't come cheap, Mum. The spell books alone are very expensive. In you go. That's it. In you go. That's it, mind your head. That's right. Now take your flu powder. What did he say, dear? Diagonally. I thought he did. I bet you loved that, didn't you, Potter? Famous Harry Potter. Can't even go to a Second-hand book. <laughs> you okay, Ron? Uh, let's take him to Hagrid. <laughs> He'll know what to do. Everyone except. Should have been brought straight to me. I can mend bones in a heartbeat, but growing them back... Ugh. And not to mention, they're dead scared that Harry will petrify them if they fly anywhere near him. Well, that too. Professor McGonagall. This match has been cancelled. We can't cancel Quidditch. Silent. <laughs> Egypt. 
What's it like? Brilliant. Loads of old stuff. Not flashing that clipping about again, are you, Ron? I haven't shown anyone. No, not a soul. Must unless you count Tom. The day maid. The night maid. The cook. That bloke who came to fix the toilet. And that wizard from Belgium. Mrs. Weasley. Good to see you, dear. Good to see you, too. Now you've got everything you need. Yep. Yes, right. all of your books. Yeah, it's all upstairs. And all of your clothes. Everything's there. Good boy. Thank you. Harry Potter. Mr. Weasley. Who? Sirius Black. <laughs> Duff Town. Come to Hogwarts. Do you? There's Dementors at every entrance. Dementors. He's already slipped past. But them. move! Oh. Professor, the fat lady is there. Oh, clever, Harry. But not clever enough. Besides, ah, we've got a better way. Guys, come on. I'm trying to get to Hogsmeade. We know. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll get you there. We'll show you a quicker way. If you pipe down. <laughs> oh, bless you. Let me go. Come on, guys. Don't. Now, Harry, come, come and join the big boys. What are you doing? Shh. What's this rubbish? <laughs> What's this rubbish, she says. That there is the secret to our success. It's a wrench giving it to you, believe me. But we've decided your needs are greater than ours. George, if you will. I solemnly swear that I am up to no good. Messrs. Mooney, Wormtail, Padfoot and Prongs are proud to present the Marauder's Map. We owe them so much. Hang on. This is Hogwarts. And that, no. Is that really? Dumbledore. In his steady pacing, does that a lot. So you mean this map shows? Everyone. Everyone? Everyone. Where they are, what they're doing, every minute of every day. Brilliant. Where'd you get it? Nicked it from Filch's office, of course. First year. Now listen, there are seven secret passageways out of the castle. We'd recommend this, this one. one. The one-eyed witch passageway. It'll lead you straight to Honeyduke's cellar. Be your best hurry. Filch is heading this way. Oh, and Harry, don't forget, when you're done, just to give it a tap and say, Mischief managed. Otherwise, anyone can read it. It was badly wrapped, and they made me do it. Did not. <laughs> Arthur! It's about. That isn't just any mangy old boot, mate. It's a port key. Time to go! <laughs> ah! <laughs> home to be home. Kitchen, we're all hungry. Yeah, get out of the kitchen, right? Beat off the table. Beat off the table. <laughs> I told you these seats would be worth waiting for. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> it's the Irish. Let's try. That is, is the best secret in the world. <laughs> There's no one like Trump. Trump? It's like a bird the way he rides the wind. He's more than an athlete. He's an artist. I think you're in love, Ron. Shut up. Victor, I love you. Victor, I do. When we're apart, my heart beats only for you. Sounds like the Irish have got their pride on. <laughs> Stop! Get out! It's the death of his head! Together! Fred George, Timmy is your responsibility. Oh! Well, every day <laughs> now for those of you who do not know the triwizard tournament that is what awaits the student who wins the triwizard tournament but to do this that student must survive three tasks three dangerous tasks wicked for this reason the minister that's rubbish that's rubbish you don't know what you're doing Done it. Cooked it up just this morning. It's not going to work. Oh, yeah? And why is that, Granger? You see this? This is an age line. Dumbledore drew it himself. So? <sighs> so, <sighs> a genius like Dumbledore couldn't possibly be fooled by a dodge as pathetically dim-witted as an ageing potion. Ah, but that's why it's so brilliant, because it's so pathetically dim-witted. <laughs> <laughs> Ready, Fred? Ready, George. Bottoms up. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes! Ready?
make me laugh. You are this, take this. Oh, oh, come on. Up there. Oh, the old school, eh? Come on, you got a goal. Go back to your knitting. Uh, this is going to be uncomfortable enough, though. All you know is suds this thing in. They're for you. <laughs> band of baboons. Try saying that five times faster. Well, to dance <laughs> is to knit the body. <laughs> Mr. Felch, if you please. <laughs> Boy. Never going to let me forget this, are you? Never. Everybody come to... Punch your heads, punch your heads, come on. Punch your heads. Right, right, step up, mate. Don't be shy. Three, yeah. One, lady. All go down. Put the fork come up. Don't be so mean. Go on, Flash. Ten to one. All that moral fibre, eh? It's great. Moral fibre? Blimey, even when you go wrong, it turns out right. Yeah, well done, moral fibre. Congratulations, Potter. Fine achievement. Thank you. The body must be moved, Dumbledore. Uh, there are too many people. Cedric Diggory get killed. Harry, thought we heard your dulcet tones. Don't bottle it up, though, mate. Let it out. Anyway, if you're all done shouting, do you want to hear something a little more interesting? was bad. He's like child Molly. He's got me. From touching the paternal black, perhaps Potter will grow. Snape's part of the order. We'll be eating down in the kitchen. Oh! Just because you're allowed to use magic now, doesn't it? This is very, very... What's the Ministry of Magic got against me? Show him. Smear anyone who claims the Dark Lord. Stir thinks Dumbledore's after his job. Fourteen years ago, he had... He's been recruiting heavily, and we've been attempting to do the same. You mean... Like a weapon. Just a boy. You say much more and you might as well induct him. That's likely. See, uh, because of you. What's going on? He's mad as what's going on. Do you believe the rubbish he's come out with about you know who? Guiding snack boxes. Sweets that make you ill. Get you out of class whenever you like. Obtain hours of pleasure from unprofitable boredom. So, you all know why we're here. We need a teacher. And tomorrow, but out there... Harry, we don't. That's why we need you. Because if we're going to have... Umbridge won't find out. The Shrieking Jack? Yes. What happens if Umbridge does find out? Who cares? I mean, it's sort of exciting, isn't it? Breaking the rules. Who are you and what have you done with Hermione Granger? Cho couldn't take her eyes off you, could she? I'm hopeless. You're, you're just flourishing your wand too much. Try it like this. Expelli armor! One second, you're up. Thank you. Shut up. I let her do that. It's good man, isn't it? <laughs> Intentional. We've been thinking, Harry. 
We could always slip Umbridge some puking pastels into her tea. Or fever fudge. They give you these massive pus-filled balls right it Sounds great, guys. Would you excuse me? Potter, without whom I would not be here. Harry. 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 Expect a Patrona. A full body Patrona. Once before, Mr. Potter, naughty children deserve to be punished. I've always felt our futures lay outside the world of academic achievement. Fred, I've been thinking exactly the same thing. <laughs> Fighting fancies, those bleed nougat are just in time for school. Puking pastels into the cauldron, handsome Peruvian instant darkness powder. A real money spin of that one. Handy if you need to make a quick getaway. Hello, ladies. Love potions, eh? Yeah, they really do work. Then again, the way we hear it, sis, you're doing just fine on your own. Meaning, are you not currently dating Dean Thomas? None of your business. Five galleons. How much for me? Five galleons. I'm your brother. Ten galleons. Voldemort has chosen Draco Malfoy. Yeah, mate. Yeah, imagine if something went wrong and we ended up a screwy specky git forever. Everyone here is of age. I have lots of experiences with that, dear Maddo. Just trying to diffuse the tension. Wow. wow. We're, We're identical. identical. Mm. Haven't got anything a bit more sporting, have you? Yeah, I don't really fancy this colour. I well, fancy this. Quick! Into the house! Oh, my boy. Georgie. Saint Mike. Come again? Saint Mike. I'm holy. I'm holy, Fred. I get it? The whole wide world of irrelated humour. And you go for I'm holy. That's pathetic. I reckon I'm still better looking than you. Minister of Magic doing here. I'm afraid it's quite extensive. You okay, Freddy? Yeah. Me too.
So spread. <laughs> <laughs> 